All right. Um, it reads. It reads decent decently enough as spit. I think it is mouth or something. I don't know what the hell what what that is. Just, And cast shadow under his nose. The light it, light source would be coming from above. So in this particular case, I want it to be coming from above. So I'm putting a cast shadow on the side of the cheek. Um, before I get to the ear, actually, let me get to the ear. Since the rest of his features are big, I'm going to make his ears smaller. I'm going to measure them out, make sure they're about the right. They're symmetrical. The ears, I don't know why I always have an issue with that. Them not being symmetrical. Make the make the top of the cranium a uh, little smaller than normal. I'm making everybody bald. Uh, I'm gonna give this guy a little bit of hair. I would have given him more hair, but I just instinctively made him bald on accident. So uh, shouldn't have done that. <laughs> but I'm in pen. Not really a lot around that. I'm gonna give him a. Uh, Kind of buzz cut look. And he has got to look more damaged. Right now he's looking too... He's just looking like a crazy dude. I mean, which he is, but... He's got to look more damaged. So I'm going to... Add a huge, uh, you know, rip or scar or protrusion or injury over here on the left side of his face. I mean, I guess he's the right, his right side, but it's my left side. I'm going to put the striations there for muscle underneath. And then I'm going to put one over here as well. Striations on the front. And I might do one over here also. Kind of make them a little random. And then I'm going to fill in his hairdo over here. I'm giving him kind of a, like I said, I'm filling his buzz cut over here. I hope that looks like hair. Looks okay. Um, and it looks kind of messy, so I'm going to try to clarify a few things. Oh, I, I'm going to give him a, forgot, still going to give him a monster neck. Because this guy's a probably body built dude, buff zombie. I'm going to do the uh, Adam's apple underneath. And I'm going to do the, uh, the little uh, they're like cords that come from the back of your neck. They go to the pit of your uh, neck over here. Back of your neck to the pit of your neck. I think they're called the sternocleidomastoides. Mastoides? I'm not sure. I think. But 
those in there. And then after that, I think, like, okay, I got the general structure. Now I'll be like, okay, this chin has to cast shadow. I still think it's a little too see this is this is a point where it's a sketch but I want it to be at least a little more clear to the viewer so I'm going to darken a few things to kind of make them uh, go back into space or into the nose shape here try to uh, make it more like one value over here They can't shut up more, more like one space. Alright, I guess that's a pretty decent sketch. I'd be uh fine with that if it's just as if it's just a sketch and I'm not gonna well I mean I'm de I would definitely go back and finish it. Uh things in his mouth look a little weird. Not to make that look like spit, it's kinda like an odd, so I might darken that up a little bit. Darken the whole thing up to push it back. Take a chunk out of his shoulder over here. All right. Uh, at this point, I just got to. I have to move on. It's just taking a while now. So that's cool for that sketch. I do like it. Uh, I'm going to move on to the next one. That's the buff zombie. So now, for the fourth one, 
in my head as well, actually, it's kind of good to see this. I really have no clue what I'm going to do. I'm still doing the thirds, top of the forehead, brow, brow line, under the nose. I'm moving my lines a little bit because I put them in the wrong place before. And then chin. Um, let's see. I'm going to make... One of the more damaged ones, then, completely damaged ones, I'll actually uh, overdo it. Should, like it shouldn't be, shouldn't be moving anymore. I'm going to start with the eyes. I always start with the eyes. I'm going to start with one eye in this case. More of a larger eye, but uh, generally intact as all the skin. Go to the nose. The nose is going to be pretty much missing the uh, the bridge and the cartilage from it. And I'm going to do something a little. different. I'm gonna let's see putting in the rest of the no the the socket of the nose. And I am gonna pull a odd twist. I'm gonna make it seem like he really got screwed up. His one right eye. And uh, his right skull and everything is messed up. But I'm gonna put a huge, huge uh, kind of battle scarred area. I'm basically making random shapes right now and I'm trying to think of how the skull would reconstruct how would it come together if that happened if something like that happened probably would be missing this whole section but I want I still want there to be uh, 